Okay, hon, not to put you on the spot, but <laughs> tell me what you're doing. Well, we've got to unstrap the car, and we're going riding in Kansas. Who knew there were sand dunes in Kansas? <laughs> right near the town of Syracuse, pretty close to the uh, Colorado border. Um, there's 1,300 acre uh, sand dune park. It's called Syr Syracuse Sand Dunes Park. We're going to check it out. All right, we've unloaded at the Syracuse Sand Dunes State Park. Uh, it's really close to the little town of Syracuse, right off uh, Highway 50. And uh, no one's here. Just a few rules. you got to have a uh, whip flag like normal in the dunes. No alcohol in the dunes. Um, dunes entrance is right over here, and this is where you have to pay to get in kind of confusing it's five dollars per driver uh, so we've got one driver I guess but on the form it asks how many total people and then they want you to calculate it by five so it's a little confusing but we just paid five dollars because John's the only one driving and uh, this is the entrance And this is out in Kansas. I think this is the only sand dune system in Kansas. As far as I know. So there's a lot of sand trails with vegetation on the side. It's mostly kind of grassy type stuff, so it's not going to hurt your tires or anything. But then it'll open up in little areas like this. Um, there is uh, one pretty big open area um, we'll take you to, but otherwise it's a lot of these little trails. Kind of reminds me of uh, some of the Oregon dunes have lots of these little trails that can be pretty Whoa. fun, but you can also almost drive off of them pretty quick. Yeah, so this is the uh, park boundary on our right. That's uh, the west side of the park. Um, so pretty easy to get from one side to the other. Not, not very big, but lots of little interspersed trails going through the sand all over the place. But if you're looking for a, a, a big, you know, set of dunes to uh, carve and bowls to, you know, cruise on, this isn't really your spot. Mostly just kind of cool, you know, trails and little spots like this where you can kind of rip around the corner. So this is the biggest open area in the dunes. A decent sized area to screw around. But most of the acreage here is covered with vegetation. There's a few good size open areas, but mostly just vegetation with lots of trails crisscrossing. All 
All right, we're back uh, by uh, park headquarters. Um, the pond's over to our right. I think I think it was like 40 acres. And um, you got the RV camp in here with the, looks like full hookups or at least water and power. And these actually have uh, trees as well, that's nice. Yeah, and it says the day camping is $15 a day. And, you know, right right out your front door is the, the pond, which is, they said it's stocked with fish, and you need a fishing license. And there's other areas to camp on the other side of the pond slash lake that looks like more like a tent camping area or just, you know, no water, no electric, dry, dry camping. camping. Yeah, or day use. Yeah. 